Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to share with you what I will be melting um, in my weekly melting basket, bag, trunk, whatever we're calling it. So this will be for Monday, February 22nd through Sunday, February 28th. And then we'll start out fresh for um, March. I'm not sure if I'll continue to do melting baskets. I'm going to see how successful I am with this week. I feel like my, it was hard to pick stuff. I feel like my scent preferences are like all over the place. So we're kind of starting to have some like warm, warm weather. It was almost 80 degrees here today by the time I got home from work. Um, but I'm still not like wanting to go all like summery, fruity, spring. So let's just get into it. I'll share with you guys what I picked. So a few from Scentsy. So I have from Bring Back My Bar, the Black Currant Bubbly. I have Plum and White Woods for my bedroom. And just to let you guys know, I will leave my Scentsy information linked below. Um, there are some major clearance items and deals going on right now um, on my Scentsy website. So I'll leave that linked down below. No pressure, no pushing. Just want to put it out there. So if you're looking for something, you may find it in the clearance section. For the classroom this week, kind of basic, is vanilla bean buttercream. Like I said, people be loving the bakery at school. So I'm just going to bring this in and we'll see how that does. All right. So I chopped up a bunch of stuff because if I put things in my basket and I don't chop them, I tend not to melt them. So we have from Teddy B's Head in the Clouds, which is White Clouds, Tiff's Favorite Lavender, and Pink Sugar. So like perfect for really anywhere in the house or in my bathrooms and bedrooms. From Rose Girls, we have Puppy Love, which is Love Spell, Green Apple, and Cotton Candy Frosting. Love this scent. Some of these are from older baskets that I just want to finish. This is from Rose Girls, 29 High Street and American Cream. I just have a couple cubes. That will be an easy, easy one to finish. Oh my gosh, difficulties today. Okay. Um, from Birdie's Making Sense, this is What's Tomato With You, and it's Wild Berry Mousse. I cut it up. It was like a little pie, and I just put the little spoon kind of off to the side in here. So this is an easy one to warm. Just wasn't grabbing for it because I didn't have it cut. From the Bunny Sisters, I have Cupcakes at the Beach. From Destination Wax, I have Moon Spice Cookie. You guys, if you have not, if you have not tried this and you love coffee scents, this is sugar cookies, coffee, and Celtic Moon Spice. This is so scrumptious and delicious. Um, so good. So this was a loaf. I have had this cut for a while, but I tend to only I only melt wax. I only melt coffee scented wax on the weekends because I'm home in the mornings to enjoy it. This is so good. Um, so it, it lasts me a while just because I really like to savor my coffee scents and enjoy them when I'm home. From Kay Scented Melts, this is her regular coffee. The lid was a little split, so I bagged it. This is what used to be her Cuban coffee. Coffee Cubano. I think it was Cuban. I don't know. But it's regular coffee. It's good. Yum, yum. From the Bunny Sisters, I have That's My Jam, which is a... I think it's Blackberry. Oh, this was in a cute shape. Chopped it all up so that we can melt that. Another one from the Bunny Sisters is Trail of Lights. I'm sorry, my nose is so off. You guys will hear about it after I melt. Um, from Empire Alchemy, this is Lavender Smoke. It's Lavender, Clary Sage, Wood Smoke, Clove, and Patchouli. Oh, so amazing. And this was in two of her waffles that I chopped up because I sure do want to warm that. Okay. 
Okay. From Ava's Country Covered, I have pie crust. It says the warm aroma of buttery, flaky, golden pie crust. Um, so there's that. Will I finish this? No, most likely not, but I need to start melting it. This one I have from before and did it warm. It's Teddy Bee's Pink Towels, Pink Sugar, and Towels Fresh from the Dryer. Mm, really good. Laundry, clean laundry scent. From the bathing garden, I have Arctic Moon, which is icy peppermint, juniper breeze, and hints of lavender. I did not cut this one up, uh, but look at this. I mean, how beautiful is that? But this is yummy. Mm, great bedroom melt, or to have downstairs at um, nighttime after dinner. So, really good. Arctic Moon. Another one from the bathing garden is Sour Summer Candy. Is that what it says? Yeah, Sour Summer Candy. And that is raspberry, strawberry, blueberry blends with lemon and lime, pineapple, and sour gummies. I do not like the bathing garden's um, raspberry usually, but I can't really smell it in here, and I've only melted a cube, and I didn't smell the raspberry, so we will melt some of that. Another one from the bathing garden is Yeti Nog, and that is uh, Lush's Yog Nog. Ugh, dupe. So delicious. My son's going to go crazy when I warm this. He absolutely loves this scent. I do have bars of it, but I just decided that we would just do like this little brick piece right here. From Ava's Country Cupboard, I have pumpkin honey chai in one of her big pie slices. I know it's pumpkin. I'm craving this, so I'm going to warm that, and I didn't cut it because that was a last-minute decision. From The Pharmacist's Daughter, this is I'm Blushing, which is 7-Up Pound Cake, Key Lime Pie, and Ice Lemon Cookies. And this smells so amazing. Oh, it's like making my mouth water. That's, um, I need to cut this one up but it's so realistic looking and beautiful that I have not cut it. And the last one from the pharmacist's daughter is um, this little gorgeous thing and way to my heart. And it's those chocolate pieces that, I mean, they look like chocolates and it's uh, Fruity Pebbles, Satsuma and Strawberry White Cake. And remember when I showed that? Oh, so... I want to melt that. It was poured January 16th, so it came really pretty in a box, and we need to get going on that. From Rainbow Melts, I have Herbal Essence, great for the bathroom, clean and fresh shampoo. Nope, we are not done yet. From The Bathing Garden, Magic Green Soup, which is the... Uh, dupe from Lush's uh, Jungle, which is rainforest fruits, rosewood, uh, tuberose, clove, cedarwood, grasses, jungle leaves, and patchouli. So, yes, please. It smells so good. Mm. Amazing. Rose Girl's Americana Peeps Cakes. Rose Girl's Booze Spooky Castle which is blueberry, vanilla crunch donuts, and monster cookie. From L3 Waxy Wonder, this was a loaf that I cut up a while ago and I've been slowly chipping away at it. It's Seaside in East Hamptons. And it's Earl Grey tea, salty sea air, and evenings in the Hamptons, which I can't remember what evenings in the Hamptons is, but this is a good um, nighttime scent, uh, fresh clean scent, good to the bathrooms, and what's not. From L3 Waxy Wonders, this is the F, F Hate. Um, I've had this for like years, you guys, years. I had a couple of them, and it just wasn't my favorite, but it is one of her charitable um, bars, so I really need to get going on this. I don't even know if it's even enough scent left. No idea. I don't even know what this is supposed to be, but. I need to get it in the warmers and be done. These from K's, which I've had these reports September 14th, 2019, and I keep hoarding them and putting them away. This is Pink Evergreen. 
I need to just melt them. I know it's not really winter and it's getting warm, but I'm not putting these away again with my winter wax. So those need to get done. From Waxmosphere, this is Sun and Sand. Yes. Again, this was in an older uh, melting basket. I just didn't reach for it. From Rose Girls, this is Bonfire Bliss Nilla Campfire Marshmallows. So definitely doable. Rose Girls Up North, which is fresh air, crisp water, pine, green apples. Oh my God, I can't even read my handwriting. I don't know what that says. Jasmine and Lily and Violet. So really nice, kind of on the masculine side. And then we have from Sensationals, Cuddle Up. I love this scent. So good. Just a good, clean, fresh scent. From uh, Rainbow Melt, this was a custom that I went in halves with Ramona Tolk. And this was the one, I think I picked this one. This is Espresso and Cookie dough, cookie Heaven. Espresso Gourmet Sugar Cookies, Danish Butter Cookies, Vanilla Butter Fudge. Um, and I just put them into smaller packages for myself to like grab and go. So a good kind of coffee. From K, we have Irish Linen. Deliciously fresh and wonderful. Ooh, yes. Um, boardwalk Marshmallow Clouds to mix, possibly. Pine Cones, I grabbed this accidentally and cut it. I thought it was a coffee one, but I'm gonna warm it. Um, tobacco Vanilla from K. Oh, so good, so, so good. So I have two sunshot cups of this. I can put this into many warmers downstairs. And okay, uh, the Sorrel and Lemon Thyme. Love, love, love this. I've been craving it. I feel like I haven't melted it for a bit. From Destination Wax, Coconut Milk, which is fresh coconut milk with a bit of fresh pineapple. Mm -hmm. I've been, this is older. I've had this since, this was poured in April of 2019. So we've got to get a move on here. And lastly, from Destination Wax, this is Vanilla Snowflake. It's creamy vanilla and warm woods sweetened with a dash of coconut. It's a Bath & Body Works type. And this is from, oh my goodness, November of 2018, you guys. Got to go. Ugh. All right. Hoarders be hoarding. So, that is everything. Get a little overview. Okay. Um, probably will not finish it all, but I need to have a variety, things to grab at, and we'll see. Hope everybody is having an amazing start to their week. Everybody safe, healthy, staying warm, um, that you're not getting hit with any more storms. And let me know down below what you've been melting or what are you going to melt this week? Are you doing a melting basket? Do you find that it helps you get through your wax? Um, I'd love to hear. Thank you guys so, so much. Take care and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.